Hey guys, welcome back to Vitamin Y. So today is Friday, that means we are using Super Vicey Bell. So of course with the new ban list with Rhoda going up to 2. The consistency, it gets helped of the stack, yay! Now can I get Summoner Monk to 3? <laughs> but seriously, uh, having Rhoda to 2 is great, you know. Always getting the Armageddon and the Dark Reference definitely does help the stack. Right now I'm still deciding whether I want to run Mystic Tomato or not. Mystic Tomato has been... Okay, you know, it catches my opponent off guard, but... <laughs> You know, if I want to run the deck in real life, that's just not going to work, because on here, I just do run around. In real life, it's best two out of three. They'll realize that I'm not setting anything besides Mr. Tomato, and they'll get wiser of it. So, that's not going to work. So, hopefully I can figure out how to help the deck's consistency without running Mr. Tomato, but the monster count is really low in this deck, and uh, there's really no other monster that can really uh, help out with the consistency of the deck. So, I'm just kind of worried about how well this deck will do. When it comes to real life, right now it's kind of just taken apart and kind of just sitting in my house, you know. Uh, just kind of sitting there. Two. I know you're not done. Is that a monster? Magical Mallet, okay. Well, that's an egg. One, but I hope it's worth it. You know, put all three back? Are you just gonna... Nope, all three back, alright. So this hand is kind of crappy. Might come down to what I draw. Definitely. Hopefully I get something. Maybe I'll get like Doom Shaman or something, that'd be nice. Oh, it's this deck. What the hell is he doing? Pretty much copying off of Asian Eyes. Okay. So now what? You can't summon another monster. It's, oh, what are you going to do? Tribute both of them and set? Nope, just going to end this turn. Okay. Yeah, this hand sucks. This hand sucks real bad. So now I need to figure out how the... What the... What the a, what the hell is he doing? B. No, I'm just going just gonna to space it. Don't even care about the mountain down right now. Space that one. Oh, okay, so he was trying to tribute for shit. Okay. Maybe beam that one. The thing is, I want to use Dark Greffer, but I don't want to fucking pitch a Dark Greffer to send something. It's just another first monarch, okay. That's weird. So, normal summon. Use the effect. I don't like to do that, but I'm pretty much going to have to right now. Put Dim Shaman right now. So at least I'm ready if I ever draw you bell or uh or uh Tinker. I got swing and supervise, but just one more card. I wish I would have had one more card. So oh never mind, it's not into the bound. I can't even destroy you bell. You bell will not be destroyed if I, you know, do the whole Doom Shaman play. Because Ebel can't be destroyed by card effects, and Doom Shaman destroying Ebel to summon Terra as a card effect, so... Well, at least Ebel uses her effect on herself, she can't be destroyed, so that's nice. Seriously don't know what we're facing so far. Summoner Monk! That helps. That really does help. So I'm going to summon this make level of chain. I think that... Then I don't have to use these two. Yeah. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do that. I'm almost done. And then he turns to defense. I'm not going to use the effect. Just going to overlay and make a level of chain. Effect. Detach and drop Tinker. And then now we can. Now we have the ability to do some plays. We are ready to make what, double bills next turn. How's that sound? Double bills? I think that sounds pretty okay. I just don't know what he's planning, you know. I'm not sure if he actually has some kind of play or some plan up his sleeve, or is it just... Is he bad, or I don't know. I really don't know. I don't trust him. Okay, he's not doing anything. Mm. So far, you know what? Just gonna night beam. Just gonna throw the night beam at it. Fuck it, I'm about to go off this turn, so fuck it. 
I just don't trust that card. I don't care about the Mound and Bound right now. But this is I'm making bills, so if he wants to drop a Malefic Cyber End, sure, go ahead. I got two bills. You want to attack me? Sure, go ahead. I'm going to go up to 4,000, and then we're just going to go and Kamikaze. Because your monsters can still be destroyed by uh, uh, battle. So it's not by card effect or be targeted, and when a level 10 or higher monster in the field d destroys monster by battle, and since I already flick the 1,000, and then when this card destroys, you get to add a divine. You're going to Night Beam? I'm gonna destroy your card. Oh, can't type. Destroy your card. Are you, are you going to do it? Thank you. The fuck is this? Your opponent wants your card and attack on a face up. Attack with this monster you control. Your opponent takes a direct attack instead and inflicts damage to your opponent equally. Make your opponent attack directly instead and inflict damage to your opponent equal to the attack. Okay. Oh, okay. Interesting. So go ahead and drop your bell, of course. All right, activate swing. This isn't. I don't think this is the game. Doom summon. Activate super rice. Get his effect. Summon tinker. And we'll go ahead and sink. Eight. I don't believe this is game, but it might be. I ha I have to see. Then it's uh, supervise chain tinker, and see. Don't want to miss the tomato. No, everything. It's all set up. You come back. Use my normal th summon for effect. Effect, and go ahead and bring back Tinker. Don't think this is a game. Yeah. Find out. If it's not, then oh well. Attack for a thousand. Is that game? Let's see, a thousand. Twenty-eight. 42. Mm, no. It's not game. It wasn't game. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and get another duel in. Nigga, please. <laughs> Alright, let's get one more duel in. At least I think that math is right. No, 50. No, wait. 28. Not 42. It was, it was 52, right? 52, 2, 52. Yeah, that was a game. That was a game. My bad. My mass is terrible. I dropped it. Didn't carry the one. <laughs> uh, so, second paper, rock, scissors as well. Alright, drew the bell. Well, at least I got Mr. Tomato and the Limit Reverse. So, yeah, it's not terrible. Not, not atrocious. I can do stuff with it. Depending on hopefully I'm not tasting anything too... Oh. Really? Oh. Well, I had to summon Dark Greffer. And if anything happens to Dark Greffer, then I pretty much lose. Because Banisher pretty much is a fuck me. Ah. People are like, oh, well, you know. D Fisher and Nakra won. This guy still had three. And the other guys, too. So. The struggle is just real. But pretty much. If something happens to my Dark Greffer right now, I had to quit. There's no way I can survive this duel. Yep, I am at defeat. Can't play. Can't play remove. I can't play removal. Cannot. No, 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 no. <laughs> you guys already know that. You already know. Yeah. So if you want to play like a Ubel deck Compelli or something, you should probably put side in some uh, Imperial Iron Walls to print Vanishing, because they're going to come at you with that shit. Ew. Unless I get a Dark Greffer. Ain't much I can do with this hand. Dark Greffer. Woo! Dark Greffer! My nigga, my nigga. <laughs> uh, 
Ah, uh, there's no point in really doing that. I'm just gonna normal summon. Alright, let's go ahead and put him to the grave to go ahead and drop Tinker. Actually, you know what? There's actually a point to do that because I opened up the limiters. It's fine. It's fine. I could take the turn. Do a turn slower. Alright, I'm gonna take your monster. A hand. Marshmallow. Alright, well, it begins. I'll set one and pass. Okay. What the fuck am I facing? Just a conglomerate of fucking just cards? I don't know so far. I just don't know. Alright, what do I want to do? Tell you the truth, I kind of just want to summon Terror. I guess I'll just go ahead, normal summon. It's a fat. Drop you. I believe that's everybody now. So I guess I could stop, start dropping forms of Evel. I'll be summoning Terror next turn, so I'll go ahead and drop Ultimate Nightmare. So I'll draw that. So that and pass. Oh, great. Oh, great. Uh. Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck. I have to do it. I have to do it. I have to play the Limitverse and summon back you, Bell. If I don't, he can go into main phase 2 and make an Ophion. At least if he goes main phase 2 and makes a 101. At least it's a 101. But. Shit, like, really? Because making that Ophion, it's like, fuck. So, that feels like a waste, but it's better than taking the damage on the chin and then main phase two and making an Ophion. This is really the only chance that I can play the Limit Reverse and ex Xeon doesn't start a chain, therefore I can't really... There's a certain time and place when you can activate cards, and that wouldn't be the right time, so I can't play that at the right time. But clearly, he's just going to go ahead and make a 101 and snatch me up, so that sucks, but at least I got some. Wow, he doesn't want to make a 101. <laughs> Fuck, then I had the right idea. I guess he's like, oh, I guess I'm not going to make an Ophion. So I'll just go ahead and summon Terror. Awesome. Nah, I'll take Dosa. Fuck, thank God. I could have sworn he was gonna do something. I'll check out his monsters. Next turn, I'll go ahead and make a f Beals and. Okay. Bills, and then hopefully I can start turning this duel around. Not that it's in the dumps, really, but... Start putting in that work, but... So far... Go ahead. Six cards in hand. Let's see what he wants to do. I got this MSC ready to go, but he hasn't, you know, set any back row. Normal summon a battle fader. Creature swap. Sure, you can have it. Sure. Sure, you can have my email. Mmm. Uh, I can make a scrap dragon. Or should I just stall? No, I'll just stall. Build up a little bit more resources. Mm-hmm. So. Destroy. Ah. 
Yeah, you know what? I'm fine. I'll just make the fucking scrap dragon. Use my normal summon for effect. Effect. Make the fucking scrap dragon. Actually, I could just make a stardust dragon. I'm running stardust dragon, right? Yeah, I do. Alright, just make a stardust dragon. Stardust Dragon. Do I want to call the Haunted? Fuck yeah, I want to call the Haunted. Go ahead. That way I don't have to destroy my MST. about to start our multi-chain during the end phase. You got anything else? So I'm going to have a Stardust and an Ultimate Nightmare because it's the owner of the card, not the controller. Since I put Ultimate Nightmare to the graveyard, I will not be, you know, summoning it from my deck. Therefore, I still get to draw that delicious Call of the Haunted. So I'll definitely be taking that. Fine. Don't touch your monster. I really don't care. Yes. What do you want, sir? When an effect is activated to destroy something, I can negate, negate, and destroy that car. Then Stardust comes back during the end phase. You just said that. You just said that. This turn. No. <laughs> you set it this turn. You set a monster, then that card put the monster back in your hand asked me a question, then summoned Vorse. I don't know about Vorse Raider. <laughs> I've been paying attention. Rebel effect. I will chain uh, Stardust. Effect. Effects. Uh, also, I'm an MST. Your fucking back row. And draw. He's like, are you sure? Like, yes. How is it not fair? How is it not fair? I've been playing completely legally. I've done no illegal move. I s doesn't matter. I still had MST. <laughs> it's not my fault that you flipped it up. not my fault. You're the one to reel it. Okay, why didn't you? No. <laughs> no. 
No. Either. You didn't need to know. Why should I tell you that I have MST? If I have MST, then I have MSP. MS, oh my god, MST. It's none of your goddamn business with my set card. Mm. If, if you knew what? So, so, you didn't set your spells, your fault, your card got MST'd. Like, really? Really? You're gonna be the- That's what you see! And then you- And then you- know, And then you- And then you didn't know this because you- then, then, Shut the fuck up! Alright? Doesn't matter if it fuck it was! It was my set card! It was my MST! It was your fault that you decided to flip up your card and be like, Oh, I'll talk! And with the fucking card that you just set this turn! That was your fault! And I was gonna MST it during the end phase despite what a bit would have been. So I don't even give a shit if you would have said, Oh, that's unfair, I should have said more spell cards. You didn't! So fuck you, you didn't do it. I swear to god. That's unfair. Really? That's unfair? Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and call up so so I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys tomorrow with the Bell and Zectors. So thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for the support. See you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching.